we have the power pack which is a Hutz diesel and this is equipped with an overspeed valve and also a spark arrester on the same skid we have the hydraulic unit and this is the control for the sludge nozzle and this is the control for the salarod pump itself we have a gearbox to control the speed so this is the control for the Salarol super suction pump. We have, as you see here, in neutral position. In normal operation, I will then engage forward. And the pumping continues as normal. If there's any problem with the pump, for example, a too large debris enters the pump here, I can then switch to reverse. The reverse will reverse the whole pump and then the debris can be discharged outwards. This is the internal of the Salarol super suction pump in a resting mode. So we have no pressure on the internal suction hose. We let the hose rest. Now we're gonna compress the hose to create vacuum. I'll take this special tool and place in. I'll press all the way and now I have compression of the hose which will allow me to get vacuum. Two bolts here and I lock the vacuum in place. is a normal standard cam lock using a standard straight nozzle for sludge or also oil spill soft and flexible three inch holes and with this I can work freely connecting the sludge nozzle is also with a normal cam lock. For oil sludge we have a very heavy pressure so we need a good standard OSD 150 hose at least. Very heavy, very durable. For oil spill we can also use um, a fire hose.
Jaha, då har vi muddring pågår här. Thank <laughs> you. 